except by opening the X door. 50 minutes left until the vote deadline. Don't tell me you want to vote. How can we not? Yeah. If we refuse, C team gets two votes automatically. We'll die. Yep. But you have to vote. Hey, do you think this could be part of the experiment? DCOM's whole psychological test. Nope. What? Why? That masked guy called himself Zero. I have no clue why he's here, but he's for real. So that means he's actually willing to kill off a whole team? Yep. Yeah. But how? He said that there's an anesthetic in our bracelets, right? So we'll be sleeping and then BAM! Or maybe... There's a bunch of different ways. But how? Uh, there was a way to contact someone on the other teams. Why would you need to reach them? What, you're planning on begging them not to vote C team or something? Well, no, but I thought, why not spread out the votes? Yep. What do you mean? Remember what Zero said? The group with two or more votes will lose. I get it. Maybe C team could vote for D team, D team for Q team. And Q team for C team. Exactly. Then all the teams would have one vote each. Yep. And that'd make it a three-way tie. A and no one would have to die? But how do we make sure they know to do it? I don't really like how they've changed the hey, faces Mira, so much. Eric! Diana! Fi! Sigma! Of characters we us? already know. Uh, it's not working. Damn it. Hey, Akane, uh, why don't you try using the morphogenetic field? Huh? Morphogenetic field? Yep. Let the game end where I treat too. What's this supposed to mean? The game will end and something about two people i guess the tough part is figuring out treat if it's like trick or treat then maybe it means there's a reward or a gift or something but it could also mean treatment which would imply being cared for either way it doesn't make sense hey uh, anyone know what this thing could be a box what's inside of it maybe some kind of a white smoke a tomate baco You've heard of it, Carlos? Urashima Taro, right? Japanese folklore. Something about jumping through time, I think. This label says force quit box. What's that? Looks like there's a keyboard. There's probably a password that goes there. Then something ends if you punch it in? But what, though? Maybe the game Zero's making us play. Wait, wait. You really think Zero'd put something that easy here? It seems like it wouldn't even have to be a box for that. Didn't think it'd work. Just pressing random buttons isn't going to solve anything. So, what now? What can we do? Maybe we should just get this voting business over with. Junpei. No, we still have some time. Come on, man. You're supposed to be the leader here. He doesn't look like Junpei from first game. She doesn't look like Akane from the first this game. Mess anyway. Do you guys have any ideas? What to ask? Who is Zero? Who is Zero? Uh, to be accurate, you should probably ask, who is the second Zero instead? Then that means there has to have been a first one, right? Yeah, there is. You know him? Sorta. Santa. I brought it up earlier. A bracelet a lot like this one has been strapped to my wrist before. Yep. It happened last year. Akane and I were trapped somewhere. The person responsible back then was named Zero. Yep. But I don't think that one has anything to do with this one. It's got to be connected. Just please believe <laughs> me. She's right. 
I can see how they're kind of Borderlands-like. What to ask? What is Zero's purpose? Why is Zero doing this? To make us play a game, right? This decision game or whatever. With the fate of mankind on the line. So it's true. Do you know something, Akane? I think... If we end up losing this game, we're all going to die. And Radical Six will be released. Six billion people will. Yep. So what Sigma said back then up in DCOM was... At this rate, this six, rate six billion, billion people, people will, will die. die. Yes. What Sigma said is the truth. Have you ever heard of the term Reverie Syndrome? What causes it is unknown. Neither the nerves nor the brain have abnormalities. But somehow, this disease causes you to stop reacting to a variety of stimuli. I've heard there are people from all over the world who have become affected by this. Hey, hold up. How does this and what we were talking about before go together? Shouldn't you know already? Huh? A crisis. Mankind is currently facing what is clearly an unprecedented crisis. Sigma Those should know. Those are sensing it's coming. Because this is... Syndrome. You've heard of it? Yeah, kinda. No, this is, um... That's not Sigma, it's, um... Akane and Junpei, isn't it? So maybe Akane and Junpei don't know about the virus just yet. I don't think they jumped back in time. No, they didn't. So I'm not sure they know about the virus. Sigma and Fire do, but they're in a different area. What is your relationship? So we are asking them, or them what their relationship is, I guess. Akane Kurashiki. Yep. Junpei Tenmyoji. Yep. You're both Japanese, right? Yes. And you both lived in Japan when you were kids. You even went to the same school. Yep. So you're childhood friends. Yep. Who told you that? Sigma. He mentioned it back in DCOM. We all lived in close quarters in that facility for five days. Information spreads fast. So, whose idea was it for you to join? Huh? The DCOM experiment. You two signed up together, right? No, we didn't. We did this on our own. Wait, you're telling me you guys just happened to bump into each other at DCOM? It wasn't a coincidence. It was inevitable. Yeah. Why did you subject yourself to this circus? I didn't mention it before. I... Well, I kind of really need a lot of cash. Yeah, something... They said they'd give us 500,000 if we joined up. Something like uh, 13 hours ahead. I'm surprised. Thought a hero of justice had no need of money. A what? Didn't you say you're a firefighter? A really good one? You faced off against danger and saved a whole bunch of people. Sounds like a hero to me. Uh, I just have good instincts. Doesn't seem to matter where I find myself. They're pretty good at telling me which path has death at the end. Looks like this one's going to have much less reading for me, which I'm not arguing against. Do you hear something? But Over it's there. a lot more story Gap. being told Where to you. Where did you come from? There's a dog couldn't dog named Gap. Looks like you made it here using this vent. Does that mean it's connected to the surface? Hmm, I don't think so. A vent to the surface would defeat the purpose of a bomb shelter. So yep. he came from another ward then. It's too dark, I can't see anything. But ward Q is down that direction, right? Think you can fit in there, Kane? Uh no, there's no way. Someone likes cake too much. Oh, I know. Let's cut off Junpei's arm. <laughs> he should be able to fit through then. Huh. 
Hey, Mira! Eric! No answer, huh? Hey, Gav. Did they steal you away from DCOM, too? But why the dog? Maybe they felt bad about leaving him alone up there? Baloney. Do you really think Zero do us any favors? Hold on. I think I got an idea that may work. This here, this case. I think I have it the same idea. Doesn't it? Uh huh. It's empty. Write a little note on it and Asterisk send it to the other rooms to. I still think this. Tell the work. others how to vote. We can use it. Wait a sec. A beer coaster and a pen. I yep. found them on the counter of the bar. Oh, there's something written on it. Oh, uh, I did that. Hello, Carlos here. C team is voting for D team. So D team should vote for Q team and Q team for C team. Oh! It is going a dog. To put it in the case and have Gab go through the vent. Cross your fingers he can get to Q team. You really think it'll be that simple? That's the plan so I was shouldn't? thinking. Well, I guess we don't have anything to lose. Why don't we give it a shot? What did you throw? It's a slow moving Jeez. dog. Picked it up with the coaster. It was over there on the counter. Why don't we just toss in some ketchup and pickles too? Maybe next time he comes back, he'll be a hot dog. Really? It was a joke. Pretty terrible joke. Five minutes left. Uh, Gab's not come back. Let's just vote, Carlos. Like I said, if we forfeit, I know. Hey, there's one thing we can do. What is it? You remember what you wrote on the Gab letter? Uh, the what? The message we sent the furry pigeon to deliver? <laughs> C team is voting for D team. So D team should vote for Q team and Q team for C team. Yeah. So what? So, vote for Q team instead. What? Junpei, you can't be suggesting. I was going to. If we do that, they'll end up with two votes and. Yep, Q team will be out. Granted, this whole thing is assuming our initial plan works. The note makes it to D team, and Diana votes the way we want her to. Think about it for a second. Six people have to die, or we're never getting out of this bomb shelter. Those are the rules of the decision game according to Zero. Balancing the votes won't do us any good. We'll just end up falsely prolonging someone's death. Junpei. The deadline to vote is in three minutes. Come on, Carlos. Vote for Q-Team. No, you can't! How could you, Junpei? Actually want to kill a team? <sighs> What I'm thinking is Junpei, Sigma, Fire, and Akane can, can all use the morphogenetic field and all do the jumping between timelines. So we could get the passcodes and save everyone to get out. I'm going to go have... Um, Junpei was saying though, Q team. Your vote has been accepted. Carlos, why? Smart move. minutes have passed. Your time limit has ended. Sleep well, as the next game will begin when you awake. Unfortunately, the team who receives two votes will be unable to participate. One final thing. You've gone through with the vote exactly as I commanded. You deserve a reward for obeying. A memory loss drug 
will not be injected into the three of you. When you next wake, those who survived will be able to regret the decision they made. As all members of a single team will perish as a result of the vault you entered. Not necessarily, but we'll see. This feels weird that we're jumping back to this screen after a few, a little bit of story. We'll go here and do the other one. I don't really know if that's how it's supposed to be done, but... Five minutes left. How do I skip dialogue? Uh, Gab's not... Like I said, it... I know! Hey. Uh, yeah? So what? So, vote for Q team instead. Why if we. Yep, right. Stu Come on. I kind of wanted to see the result of that and do the timeline first, but. Doing this, we won't know which one re resulted into what story. Your vote has been accepted. Ah, oh, I was worried you weren't going to do it, Carlos. You'll see, Akane. Just because we did what we said we would doesn't mean this will work. Hell, we don't even know if our note reached the other teams or not. And even if it did, there's no guarantee they did what we asked. Two possibilities will come out of this. The three members of D-Team will die. Or it's our heads on the chopping block. 90 minutes have passed. Your time limit has ended. Sleep well, as the next game will begin when you awake. Unfortunately, the team who receives two votes will be unable to participate. One final thing. You've gone through with the vote exactly as I commanded. You deserve a reward for obeying. The memory loss drug will not be injected into the three of you. When you next wake, those who survived will be able to regret the decision they made. As all members of a single team will perish as a result of the vault you entered. Pleasant dreams. I like that they choose they're trying different things with the game, but I'm not sure if it's a good way to do it. All sections cleared. So now I've got no more here. May as well save. Ah, there we go. That's the flow chart so far. There we go. That's where I wanted Q team then. I'm guessing that's already complete. Yep. <sighs> Prep room. Decontamination room. Quantum computer dome. Pod room. 
biolab. This is weird. There should be another room around here somewhere. Uh, let me see it. Uh, hey! Shut up! He's got the right to see it too. Yeah. Mira. Thank you. He is the leader of the team after all. It's pretty pointless to hang out here kicking our heels. Let's go back to the lounge. What is this? Let's inhibit the virus. Maybe someone's going to remove or control some kind of virus. Virus? What virus? More release a virus. Um, about the vote? What will we do? Don't ask me. But if we don't do it, doesn't that mean we'll die? Yep. Yeah. Even if C team voted for D team, and D team did the reverse. If we refuse, then we get two votes against us automatically. And Q team would be killed. I suppose that's true if this game is for real. So you're saying it's a joke? Don't you think that would make a whole lot more sense? The DCOM staff will probably pop through that door over there yelling surprise. Oh, <laughs> I get it. You're right. Then him being here makes sense now. I bet that means you're part of the whole surprise. Mm. No! Come on. Take off that helmet. I can't. Huh? I said I can't take it off. Damn, brat. Stop bullshitting me. Uh, stop! Stop! You'll break my neck! Don't do that. Damn. It's really on there. Wait. I see something on the side of this thing. Keyhole? A button. What the hell? Huh. Isn't it a password input? It is. Looks Does that like mean it. the helmet comes off with the right numbers? Or maybe his head will explode. Uh, hey! Really? Who are you? I don't know. I don't remember. I woke up and I was here. Are you saying you have amnesia? Um, maybe. Of course, another character with amnesia. Could I ask you something? What? Who is Zero? I was wondering, um, who is Zero? Oh, come on! Stop playing. You know everything, don't you? I told you, I don't... So you're gonna stick with the idea that this isn't some big surprise? I don't know. I don't remember anything. If this isn't a joke, then things are really serious. Then you're saying one of the teams is actually going to be executed? It does seem that way. But why would someone do that? Zero said, it's a game. So then he's a psychopath. This Zero guy's probably off somewhere enjoying seeing us freak out. He could be that serial killer in the news. That's that heart ripper, yeah? Yeah. Rumor is they killed 18 people, all in the past few years. Ooh. March 15th, 2026. The body of a young female was found in a park in Roseville. Missing the victim's heart. name was Virginia Bailey, age 28. The chest was ripped open and the heart entirely removed. Damn. It happened again on May 22nd, 2026. The body of a male was found in a trash can near a residence in Sacramento. The victim's name was Jeffrey Foray, age 37. His body was just like Virginia's, with the heart completely gouged out. Two months later, on July 29th... Hey, wait a minute. Yeah. Don't you have amnesia or something? Just what Why I was thinking. Why do you know all this? I don't know. Uh, I don't know why. Why does a knew. kid know You've gotta be that. kidding me. 
that's pretty dark for a kid to know. Exactly who, when, and where each one was murdered. Whoa. Where are we? I was wondering, where are we? Weren't you listening to Zero earlier? We're 50 meters underground in a bomb shelter. I know that, but where exactly? Uh... I doubt we're very far from DCOM. Uh, DCOM? Dwelling for the cohabitation of Mars. So, it's an experiment to see if we could survive on Mars? Uh-huh. We all lived together in that compound for five days. No problem, Pickles. C-team and D-team were there too. Oh, and there was a dog. It was incredibly old. I think his name was Gab. But not you. You weren't there. It's very suspicious. Oh, what were they testing for? Psychological data, mostly. It was a closed environment for a group of people for an extended period of time. So how would that mess with the subjects mentally? That was what they were trying to investigate. Uh, what made you sign up? <laughs> Tough question. It seemed like it'd be kind of fun, I guess. Eric? I joined because Mira wanted to. That's it? Well, maybe not entirely. Okay, so... I forget his name already. And Mira knew each other. Not Carlos. Yeah, I can't think of his name. What is your relationship? Mira. Eric. Eric. What's going on between you two? Like, obviously... What's going on? Uh, uh... Well... Are you in love? Idiot! No, we're not! <laughs> we're not? Well, we're not not, but... <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> you know, I've been trying to figure something out for a while. What is this thing? Maybe it's a gift from Zero. So, what, you think there's assorted teas inside? Gifts don't have to be a good thing, do they? Hey, what the hell? Stop! What if it's some kind of bomb? A bomb? Mm, I don't think it is. Oh, something's on the back. Um, I think this is upside down. So, this would be the front. Force quit box? I guess it stopped something. Look, there's also a keyboard. Looks like you're supposed to input a code of some kind. And if we get it right? Then something will be forced to end? But what? Maybe... Your life. What was that sound? It came from that way. Oh, let's go! Gab? How did you... You came through the vent. It's too dark. I can't see anything. Why don't you go in? Uh, I can't. Just do it, will ya? <laughs> see? You didn't have this stupid thing on your head. Hey, check this out. There's something inside the case. Is that a coaster? Oh, there's something on it. Hello, Carlos here. C-team is voting for D-team. So D-team should vote for Q-team and Q-team for C-team. What does this mean? Don't you get it? They're saying to spread the votes. Yep. Huh? Spread? I get it. If each team ends up with one vote each, the whole thing is a tie and no team will be executed. Exactly. Oh, 